king's throne. It's dark in here. Yeah, you can pull off the iron butterfly in here. She's always cold. Upgraded av uh, avionic avionics. <laughs> Upgraded avionics. We're flying now. Hey there. Today we're looking at the Bighorn 3375 SS. So let's get to it. Here's the storage. If you couldn't tell, look how big the door is. Absolutely huge. Slam latches. Let's get going. Check out the windows. They got frameless windows, and you also have two awnings that cover almost the entire side of the coach. Here we are at the back of the coach. We got a ladder already pre-mounted, so if you need to do your inspections, you don't need an extra ladder, and it is pre-wired for Furion backup camera. So let's keep on going. It does have upgraded suspension. Here's your wet bay. Already has a water filter hooked up for you, which is cool. I really love that. All your connections. What I really do like, the water compartment or the water bay, if you will, is its own area. So heaven forbid you spring a leak, it's gonna be contained in here. It's not gonna flood out this area. What's that? All right, well, up the front, here you have a normal pin box. Here's your storage area, um, uh, front storage, but you can also, if you wanna mount a uh, generator, you would put it in there. And here is your control for your auto level system. Now this one is hydraulic. Um, and so I like when they're here so you can see it coming off your truck so you have more control, all right? Oh, and did I mention step above steps? I bet you want to see the inside. Come on in. Well, hey everyone, welcome to the inside. So I love opposing slides. We talked about this in a lot of videos. And look, a lot of RVs these days, especially fist wheels, they have opposing slides in the living, dining, kitchen area. Uh, it just gives you so much more space. So let's start down here. Um, what a beautiful cushy couch. I mean, I don't know if you can see this, but I literally just sunk into it. Absolutely comfortable leather couch, okay? This does pull out to become a bed. So if you have extra guests over, there's an extra bed for you. Up above, you've got some storage. I'm gonna call this tall man storage because, well, I'm six foot four and, and I'm having troubles, okay? <laughs> over here, you've got your theater seats. Thomas Payne, now these are fully electric, so you just press a button and they recline. There's also heat, massage, and if you really care, there's a light that kind of lights up your drink cup, which, whatever. <laughs> now, across from this, if Lisa turns around, you will see an absolute gigantic TV. It is, uh, if you look beneath there, it's got sound bar in the left and right area there. It, it's got a DVD player mounted. It's got a whole upgraded audio package. And beneath there, my wife's favorite thing, the Furion Fireplace. She's always cold. So let's move on. So if you look over here, we have our microwave. This is a convection microwave. Convection! We have a three burner stove with an Oh yeah, look at that, yeah. Yes. Um, storage drawers underneath and around it. We've got storage cabinets on top. Um, moving over this way, we have our refrigerator freezer. Refrigerator on top, freezer on bottom. Wow, it's nice pull out huge. Drawer. Yes. Beautiful Furion is. refrigerator. It is. We have our um, the sidebar over here, so you can put your, your uh, toaster and coffee pot and instant pot and everything else over there. I'm putting my Vitamix there since I got my Vitamix, Vitamix back. Vitamix goes there, absolutely. We have plenty of storage overhead, plenty of storage underneath. And then over here to my right, we have this beautiful island. This is offset the way Robert likes it. So like it offset. That'll make him happy. Now look at the sink. It's like a 70-30 or something. Yeah, yeah, look at that. I like that. That's right. cool. That's Isn't a neat that design. Nice? And we do have plenty of storage underneath the sink as well. Yeah, look at that. Yeah. Oh, with a trash can already in there. Absolutely. Yeah. There's a couple <laughs> things that we didn't mention that I want to point out. One, you notice the two-tone and the cabinets, right? So there's your kitchen. There's your living room. So it's kind of nice how there's sort of a dividing line with the colors and they don't clash at all. Um, the other thing is, if you look at the doors that have glass in them, they've got a really sort of neat sort of pattern in there. It just sets it off and nice backsplash. I mean, there's just some of these details that we forget to mention sometimes, like the LED lighting 
that is in the ballasts here or, uh, across the slides. I mean, it's just, right? Beautiful pendant lights, ceiling fan. I mean, there's so many of these amazing little details that we miss when we do the uh, reviews and we apologize. Um, but hopefully what we're doing gives you a general look and uh, you're interested to make the phone call to get a deeper look. So here we are in the dinette. Yes, nice little table and chairs. There's a couple more chairs that come along with it. Yep, so this is set up in its two person mode. It is. And it slides out. That's sort of, it just, you see the seam there. It slides out and can seat four, which is really nice. Absolutely. All right, so let's go up here. What do we got going on up here? Oh, it's the bathroom. You know what time it is. It's time for Thomas Toilet Test. <laughs> Porcelain foot flush toilet, which is great. Um, and as you can see from uh, where I'm sitting here on the throne, it is a nice throne. It is a king's throne. At least a tall man's king's throne or something. Anyway, all right, plenty of room. So now directly across from here, is the sink now that is not laminate that is solid surface okay um they have not spared expense in here with the finishes so it is under counter mounted it's all formed as one piece it's absolutely amazing lots of countertop space you've got cabinetry up here you've got your medicine chest here now for the tall people in the world um i can only see from here down okay so I'm gonna have to go down like this to be able to, to see in the mirror, okay? Down beneath, there's three drawers. There's storage underneath. I mean, really very, very cool. You do have a max fan installed, so you just hit the button here and it goes on and opens and all that cool stuff, okay? So let's climb in the shower. Okay, so we are in the bubble, um, which is great, uh, which gives us the room that we need to have in here. Okay, this is obviously a little corner shower. Um, the bubble is in a decent place that I do have some maneuverability in here. Um, I was in another corner shower recently and I was literally stuck in the corner because that's where the, the skylight was, the bubble. Um, and so this one here, I can move all the way around. The shower head's in a decent place for a tall person. So uh, yeah, all in all. Now there's only one thing about this bathroom that we don't like, and I'm not sure if you could tell yet, but it is really dark in here. We've got all the lights on and it's, it's pretty dark. But other than that, it's a beautiful bathroom. Just need one more light. We forgot something. Look at this. There's storage in here, all right? Where are you gonna put your towels? You're gonna put your towels right here, all right? Huge storage cabinet, all right? I can't believe I forgot that, all right? So let's go somewhere else now. Welcome into this gigantic bedroom. Look at this. I mean, you remember that thing that we pointed at on the outside? That was a double slide. Here it is. So here's the first part of the slide. And then here's the second part of the slide. So look at how much floor room is in here. And that is an actual residential king. You, you could do a workout in here. I mean, Pilates and yoga and yeah, you could pull off the iron butterfly in here. I don't, I don't know yoga, I'm sorry. All right, anyway, so next to the bed, you got a little shelf here with some power and charging station for your phone, okay? There's also a charging station up here. So if you wanted to put it there and then maybe put it up on the balance, you could do that. If I roll over, it's the same thing on this side. There's charging station here and a charging station there. There is no power on this side though. It's only over there, okay? Directly across from where I'm sitting, in fact, the lovely Lisa turns around, there is your dresser, beautiful four drawer dresser. And there's also a, a nice cabinet next to it too, so you have tons of storage in here, guys. All right, nice small TV already mounted. And then we get to the front, here is your actual closet closet. Um, there is, <laughs> is that a Dyson? Yeah, a Dyson comes with it, right? Uh, hanging rod, just beautiful. Remember we mentioned the other chairs? They're also kept in this closet. Um, and so that's where they would be stored. Um, but when you get somewhere, you just pull those out. Now this one is where you'd have your washer and dryer. If you're gonna do a stackable, 
um, then the shelf and the rod would come out. If you're not going to do a washer and dryer, or even if you're going to do a combo, then you'd have some more hanging space in there. And so, um, yeah, that's pretty cool. Guys, I do believe this is our very first time in a Bighorn. And to be honest, we are amazed with the quality at this price point. I mean, this one is listed at 60 grand, you know, 59,998. Now, to be honest, the list price is like 96,000. So it's like 35% off. But still, that's not the point. The point is it's at amazing price point and it has so many higher end features. Guys, if this is the first time you found us, thank you so much for staying and watching. You know what to do, right? If you've come back again to see one of our videos, thank you for returning. We really do appreciate you. Think about subscribing and sticking around, okay? Until we see you all again, be safe.